Hi guys, it's Alan here from Compass Media and today I have another fantastic LinkedIn tip for you. And today I'm going to be talking about customized LinkedIn URLs, okay? Simple, simple thing, but very, very effective. Um, basically what we're going to be doing is, is we're going to show you how you can customize your URL in LinkedIn, okay? Very, very simple. So without further ado, let's get into this. Okay, so you can see we are here on my uh, profile page is where you will need to be to in order to uh, enable this feature. Okay, you already have got a LinkedIn uh, URL. So when people see it or where you can copy it okay but nine times out of ten what you will have is is a, a number of uh, words and or a number of letters and a number of um, numbers as well after your name okay but what we want to do is to be able to change that and just have your LinkedIn pro your LinkedIn link and then your name beside it okay very very simple very very easy to do so as you can see we are here in my profile and if I click on the contact details here you will see this is where my profile uh, link is my customized URL so it's linkedin.com forward slash in forward slash Alan Hennessy okay now I have already changed this but if you want to change it and yours is not changed already this is the simple way of doing it so basically what we do is is you click on the pencil tool and when you click on the pencil tool it brings up your LinkedIn profile with all your details um, and what you're looking for is, is up the top it has profile URL and if you click on the little uh, box with the arrow in it you can literally go to your uh, public uh, profile settings okay and over in the right hand corner here um, on the screen you'll see edit, edit your custom URL and basically this is personalizing your URL for your profile okay so if you click on the little pencil tool it will bring you to the actual so as you can see here it is www.linkedin.com forward slash in forward slash Alan Hennessy now when you click on that you will probably have another forward slash and a number of uh, numbers and letters after that okay basically all you do is, is you click into it and you highlight it and you can see here where I have it highlighted and you literally just um, uh, delete basically the numbers okay so you just from wherever the forward slash after your name is just delete them numbers it'll then th tell you as to whether that name is available and if it's not available what I would suggest to you is is maybe put in your middle initial if it's gone already if it's or else you can put a hyphen in there whichever suits you okay but just to distinguish it and then you just press it and it'll let you know as to whether it is available or not okay so depending on the um, the person's name or the whatever you put in there it'll allow you to do it once you have it done and it is right you can see then all you do is, is just press the save button and when you press the save button, you'll get a note down on your left hand corner saying uh, that success, we've updated your settings. Search engines can take some time to detect changes and LinkedIn uh, does not control the refresh process. OK, but nine times out of 10, guys, if you go back to your LinkedIn profile immediately, it should show up uh, the effects of doing that as well. OK, so as, it, as you can see here, once I click on my contact details, it will be there. Okay. Now, if I've, as I said, I've already done this, but um, you will see the changes that have been made um, almost instantly. So I do hope this is of some use to you, and uh, this will help you. Ideally, what I would suggest is, is, and this is another added bonus of a tip, is is that when you do do this, what you can do then is is to take that URL and add it to your email signature, so people can find you easily from your email by clicking on the hyperlink 
to your actual URL on LinkedIn and it'll help them to see your profile on LinkedIn as well. And hopefully the next stage that they will take or the next step that they will take is, is to actually go and connect with you. Okay, so <clears throat> just another added bonus for you. So I do hope this information was of some use to you and uh, you will you will put it to uh, work and you will implement this. You know, it's about cleaning up your profile and making sure that it has all the best opportunities for people to connect with you and the same with um, if you're on social media and you wanted to send someone your LinkedIn profile like that again just copy the actual URL and then just send it to the person and either in a message or on a post or whatever it may be that you're going to use this for you can also use it of course on all of your printed material as well so people can find it as well there okay guys so I hope this as I said was of use to you and uh, you will implement it and I look forward to seeing you soon okay and uh, if you like this video please do share it and let people know about this little tip for LinkedIn okay you can also uh, jump on to the website at compassmedia.ie forward slash uh, training for all details of all the training that we do and also you can subscribe to our YouTube channel as well where we also put all of these videos up as well okay so guys have a great day and as I always say be social until next time bye bye